see keyword properties for about general like understanding the change in description which will change the heading of the column then aggregation behavior by default every keyword takes a standard aggregation from the back end but if you're not happy we basically use this into format and control the aggregation behavior and what is the extreme, if you have a question saying what is the aggregation except aggregation every keyword when used in the query must have aggregation function which by default it is uh, some version from the standard aggregation from the back end if you want it to work apart from the sum with any other aggregation function like count, min, max, you would go with what? Aggregation function. Use the keyword into formula, then control the aggregation. Then display, do you want to show this keyword or hide it or always hide it? Um, highlighting and then number of decimal places, how many you want, number of scaling factors, what you want. Whether minus symbol should be shown or you want to show reverse. Minus reverse, minus will be shown as plus, plus and plus will be shown as negative. And this is what you need when you basically use a keyword as in uh, nodes like this like a hierarchy kind of stuff if you build a nodes so now I have this node and just collapsing it now I want this to be collapsed or not that's what control did this property then extend it if you select this the same result will be shown on the, on the entire column then we can use this for currency conversion you'll, you'll get to see the conversion types what is different T RS curve if it is unit conversion um, for quantity key figures, if you go to convert, if this is enabled, you get to see all the units what is made under the um, RSUOM version. And this for planning and calculate this for controlling how the result has to be calculated and calculate single values to control how the single values should be calculated and whether you want it to be accumulated and you want that to be applied to results or not. And we can say if it is accumulated, what should be the direction along the rows or along the columns? Because if this will work out, when you do drill down across or drill down rows.